Most of us don't think about how our everyday activities might influence the global environment. An example is our use of chlorofluorocarbons, or CFCs. These compounds are useful as refrigerants, solvents, and aerosol propellants. When released into the air, these chemicals disperse throughout the atmosphere. In the upper atmosphere, there is a layer containing a small amount of ozone. The ozone layer is important to living things because it blocks harmful ultraviolet rays from reaching the surface. A few years ago, scientists discovered that CFCs, even in very small amounts, cause ozone to break down. When CFCs reach the upper atmosphere and are exposed to ultraviolet light, they release a highly reactive gas, chlorine monoxide. The chlorine monoxide acts as a catalyst. It breaks down ozone molecules, but it isn't changed itself. A single molecule of chlorine monoxide can destroy thousands of ozone molecules. A severe depletion of the ozone layer would result in an increase in cases of skin cancer, eye cataracts, and suppression of the immune system in humans and other species. Food crops sensitive to ultraviolet rays could also be affected. In 1984, a hole in the ozone layer was discovered over Antarctica. More recently, a similar hole has been discovered that extends over the Arctic, Scandinavia, and North America. We can help protect the ozone layer by being careful about what chemicals we release into the air.